What about uh, LeBron's tweets? No, oh, what he tweet? Man. You got the tweet? What no, tweet? well, he, it was simple, right? It was accountability, a picture of uh, the dude that shot the 16-year-old. What's her name? Uh, Micaiah Bryant? Oh, the girl that was trying to stab another girl? <laughs> yeah. didn't, didn't he also say, <clears throat> you're next? Or something like that? He well, said, you're yeah, next. But- uh, hashtag accountability. Yeah. They- with yeah, the but- picture of the cop. Wow. What did that mean, though? What did that mean? Wow. Well, since, Accounta- accountability. You're next. Yeah. yeah since, um, you know, Chauvin got, you know, convicted of three three counts, he feels that this uh, officer probably will be next to where he'll get convicted. Well, I don't know. This is different. Man. Right. Right. And that's why everybody, especially everybody on the right, was getting at LeBron for for, for that tweet. They don't like LeBron to begin with. Well, right, true, true, correct. Oh, because of his comments to uh, Trump. Yeah. And, oh, and then Trump responded to LeBron and what was he like, say? he said, "Oh, you you like you're spewing racism." Um, that's racist. Well, he said, "Oh, stick to stick to playing basketball." <laughs> that wasn't him. That was somebody else that said that. That wasn't that wasn't Trump that said stick no, to no. playing basketball. No, no, that was somebody else. That's an, uh, a lady. I forgot her name, but. Yeah, that was no, it. that was old. But recently, yeah. Trump has made a comment oh, like Trump that too. Said it again. Yeah, this was recent. Oh, okay. he was like, "You, you need to stick to doing what." He's like, "LeBron is a phenomenal player, whatever." I'm paraphrasing, by the way. Um, yeah. but stick to shooting the ball. Yeah, <laughs> I don't like what people tell people. Shoot that. the ball, not your stick, mouth. Listen, stick to podcasting, guys. I'll be like, all right. <laughs> all right I'm gonna talk about you. I'm, I'm not gonna get offended. Yeah, that's a little right. different. All right. I, I thought right. one reporter was really good. Um, dude from ESPN. He said something that really stood out. He's like, you saw that I posted it on CHHTS. Shout out to CHHTS. He said something like, yo, you know, LeBron, uh, you know, he was he he jumped the gun pretty much. He didn't get the yeah, context exactly on the whole thing. Like the word says, right? Uh 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 you know, oh, um, hear the yeah, full rushes to to without hearing the whole matter, right? So mm-hmm. he was basically explaining it like that. And one of the quotes he says, uh, sometimes we don't always sometimes it's better not to always be first, but it's better to be right. And meaning, like, you know what I mean? It's Marcellus Wiley. Like sometimes we always want to be the first to post it and the exclusive and jump on it and spread our wisdom. And he's like, "Yo, take take some time to digest it. See see what the what the uh, issue really is, and then speak about it." You know does I mean? oh, the tweet still exist? That's Fox, right? Nah, he removed it. He removed it. Okay. Uh, yeah, LeBron removed it and said that LeBron. Uh, LeBron. <laughs> LeBron said, "Um, <laughs> what was it? Oh, he he removed it because he he felt like it was spewing more hate than if anything." So then why put it up there? Yeah. But um yeah, he man, got I saw I saw it, it ain't just the people from the right. I saw some I saw a hood dude post something about LeBron. Like, yo, coming from the dude that gets his shoes done in communist in China. China. Mm. Hey, he was right. quiet about China too when it was out there. Right. But he's like, you get your shoes made out there. But here you go from the behind the gates of your Beverly Hills home trying to relate to everybody in the hood. Yeah, well, that's what that dude uh, Marcellus was talking about. Like, he's like, bro, like you are you're a millionaire. You know what I'm saying? And and you move to 10 different homes. You know what I mean? And you 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 live in the American dream. You know what I'm saying? Like, um, so I thought that was interesting. the video we posted on CHHTS. Um, it's like maybe three minutes long. And he just yeah, kind of going off on a rant. Oh, um, Marcellus Wiley? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it was good. It was good. I I I agree with him. Yeah, that was dope. But that other dude, when he was saying, like, you're not not with us or you're not a cop, so you can't, like, I I don't think that's always true. Like, who said that? I think it was Officer Tatum, one of them, one of the right wingers. Like, I didn't. Why don't you do their job and then see how you react and how you, you know what I mean? I'm like, "Mm." I get it. I, I expected him to say that though. That dude, you know, is very rarely does he does he call out cops for you know doing something wrong. 
Yo, oh, you seen Matt? What's his name? Uh, Mash Trey. Yeah, he was going in on him today. Yeah, I'll right. tell you them, right? Yeah, oh LeBron. On Tatum. Tatum. Oh, yeah, yeah. That joint was like 20 minutes, man. I ain't finished it yet. Man. I'm like halfway through. <laughs> I can't I can't do those those type of videos, man. Listen, do not dude send me aggressive. Them dudes five, ten minute aggressive. videos, man. Especially on Instagram, because there's no two times the speed. Like I can't. I send these guys videos, like I read screen record, and it's always like two times the speed, and they're like, yo, you don't got a slower version? No. Right. I mean, it don't work like that. <laughs> yeah. I hate watching stuff on Instagram. You know, OJ responded too. So oh, yeah. OJ. We talked about it last week, didn't we? No, nah, Did we, we didn't. No. Nah. This what is OJ came say? Out. He said the same thing, similar. Like, yo, you know, you reacted too quickly. He was real cool about it. And then Boozy came. Come oh, on, yeah. dog. We supported you, dog. Come on, the man. black people supported you, man. Don't, Don't cut off that. his. <laughs> <laughs> not, fla- not, not flavor, flavor. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. You know, on, black man. people, we supported you, man. You're supposed to back up the blacks. He said, he said, we he said we got you out. Like, <laughs> how? Because oh, of the lawyer. Because of the lawyer. Because <laughs> of the lawyer. You ain't no Johnny Cochran, bro. Get out of here. <laughs> Come on, man. I just don't know why, why, why the, uh, like, skin color is always like, well, we, we have, we share the same skin color, so we agree on all ideas. Right. <laughs> Come on, man. I don't get that either. Like, uh, you got Muslims, Christians, all types of different people with different ideas. Yep. You expecting all of us to just uh, agree? Agree? Nah. We that was strange, agree. though. That they was strange. Who got the best biscuits? I ain't gonna front. It was who strange that OJ was making a comment and then Boozy was making a comment. Like, it's right. like, what? Like, two I'm far like, ends. Yeah, I'm like, some crazy times, man. I guess everybody want to speak their wisdom, get their wisdom off. Everybody ain't got wisdom, you know? That that's part, true. though. That's very, very true. Terrible. Yeah, y'all seen oh, well. that? Yeah, y'all seen yo, Josh, that? Yo, Josh, I'm posting that video right now onto our Telegram chat. If you're not subscribed to our Telegram chat, link in the bio. Oh yeah, yeah. He he made um he made some good comments. I like what he said. I just don't like the name calling. Like you know what I mean? Y'all this, y'all soft. You know, I'm, I, and I'm paraphrasing. I'm saying it in the cleanest manner. You know what I mean? He's cussing, saying they soft, they this. Like, why the name falling, man? I oh, don't know. Just speak your truth and. Yo, what's out. speak your truth, man? Yo, speak your truth. Uh, huh. what if, speak what if truth. my truth says yours is a lie? Yeah, this dude's been listening to 116. Wow. <laughs> this dude's reformed, bro. <laughs> Even listening to that one. Nah, that he's not listening to 116. He's listening to Way of the Master. <laughs> that's that's uh I'm rebel. Kirk Cameron, Kirk Cameron and them. He said, What if my truth says your truth is a lie? <laughs> yeah. Is it still true? So what y'all thought about uh LeBron and go good together? <laughs> Did LeBron back down? I think he backed down. Yeah. I think he saw what was going on and it was like, oh, I jumped the gun. <clears throat> He's like, dang! Everybody did not agree with me. Yeah, yeah. I had a disagreement with one of my homeboys. Oh, really? About it, yeah. About what? Because he's like, oh, he should have tased her. He could have did this. He could have that. And I'm not. I didn't disagree. I was like, yeah, he could have. <laughs> but I'm not. Am I gonna be like? What are you doing? What are you doing if uh, someone's about to stab your daughter? Right. You go, you gonna fumble now, for the taser and hold now I'm gonna be the, honest. If that was my daughter yeah. doing that to someone else and she got clapped, I would definitely be like, Yo, I would, you know, I'm gonna be broken by that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'll be like, Yo, this was a little girl, you know what I'm saying? But sure, was a little made, girl with a knife, yeah, she just about to stab somebody, but they said she got jumped, right? No, that was the original story. That she was getting jumped, but she wasn't the actual one who made the call. Oh, yeah. So, so who made the call? It was that was the story did, that was. Did you guys? Around. Did you? Okay. So there's another video where you see like the body cam footage after the fact, 
and there's a girl like in a sweatsuit. I think it was a pink sweatsuit or the something girl, like that. That's the one she was gonna stab. She's the one that made the phone call. Yeah, you see, she's the one that made the phone call in and um it's just disappointing because it was like there was a man you saw the man kick that girl in the face yeah come on man like that dude that dude could have done something to 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 stop all of this right but you know we we like ratchet yeah. that's what i was gonna say it but was that adults around that me. was funny because he kicked the girl in the face and then when the girl got shot he was like oh she's a little girl but you just kicked the girl, kicked the little right girl in the face right you know what I mean? Right. So from the body, from that body cam footage, I saw that the cop was getting out. Ma, what's her name? I think it's Makaya. Makaya. Mm -hmm. She That's came fine. rushing at that one girl. Then dude kicked the girl. Yeah. Then Makaya mm -hmm. got up and rushed the girl in pink with the knife in his hand. And mm -hmm. the officer clearly said, put it down, put it down. Yeah. In the heat of the moment, the rage, she went. I mean, she was, it looked like she was going, yeah, jig her up. Yeah. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Yeah. Mm, I don't think she was. Nah. You don't think she was going to stab her? Nah, because when you see it, she she pulled her arm back. It, this dude sound like Myson. She pulled her arm, nah, because she pulled her arm back, right? Like she was. And then she brought it back over, like she trying to scare the girl. To me, I think if she was gonna stab her, she had she she could have just did it with that one swing right there. I think she was doing just trying to scare the girl. But yeah, yeah. but as a cop, and you see that you're not gonna really try to at the heat of the moment, you're not you gonna don't do have it. time, right? Yeah, you're not you, really going what, what you what you doing? What you doing someone do that to your son or your daughter? You gonna wait to find out? You're gonna wait to find out if uh they're trying to scare your kid. No, I'm not saying that. I'm I'm yeah. not I'm not saying that. I'm saying that from yeah. looking at the video, I it didn't look like she was really like because she had more than enough time to stab this girl if she wanted to, yo. She chased her around, she had the knife. Like if you're really gonna stab somebody, you're not but, gonna go through all of that, yo. But the thing is, she threatened you you hear her clearly saying, like, I'm gonna stab I'm gonna stab you up. I mean, yeah, I'm sure she yeah. That's the whole thing you know I'm saying. That's what she's doing with the knife. She's getting bro. People that are gonna stab somebody, they're not gonna announce it. You getting stabbed, yo. You don't just be like, yo, come here, I'm gonna stab you. Yo, you get stabbed. Yeah. People, you know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, now shooting, people, even with shooting, unless they they announce it the day before, I'm gonna come back and shoot the place up. You know what I'm saying? But people don't come out with their gun like, yo, I'm gonna shoot now. You know what I'm saying? They start shooting. Yeah. Nah, people do. People do. People you, be like, "I'm a yeah, shooter." You gotta take threats seriously. You know I mean, man. like when you, yeah, when you, when you yeah. in that moment, like people do do that. You know, people you see it in movies too. People like the monologue. You know, I'm gonna shoot you. Uh, you know, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do that. You know, whatever, whatever. You know, like it happens, bro. It happens. It's 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 possible that that she was doing. You know, she was doing all that posture and yeah, maybe to scare her, but like. I don't know, man. You take your chances, and then what? Now I'm not saying yeah. what he did was wrong because as a cop, yeah. No, I know, I know, I know. Like yeah. he's, you know, what I'm saying, yeah, he could have tased her. I'm sure he could have did that, but the heat of the moment and in his mind, he was trying to save the other person. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So I the, the, the thing, that. the thing too, though, is like sometimes tasers don't work. We've seen that happen when people pull out the tasers, right? Like he could have shot her depending on the clothing that she's wearing. I don't remember what she was wearing or whatever, but like if you're wearing a hoodie, sometimes that joint don't work. So then what? He he tries to tase her, it don't work. He ends up she ends up stabbing the girl, and then you know, bro. And then he yeah. and then he has to shoot her, and now there's two girls dead. You know, I don't know. It's, yeah. That's a tough decision. That that definitely was a tough call. At first, I was like, because you know, the media only played the video of the girl. With her feet, you know, like showing her feet, the right. dead girl on the floor and the cop there. And so you're like, oh, man, I can't believe the cops just shot this 15 year old girl, you know, right. but. You know, like you said, what's crazy to me is all those adults there letting that happen and then yeah. want to wait for the cops to even come in. Right. All of this to happen. So now one adult could have stopped any of this. Well, that's what the mayor said, right? Well, what did he, he like, say? He was like, yo, we failed her as a community. 
Yeah, he did say that. He did say that. Yeah, because that's crazy. Y'all, y'all all sitting around just watching this? And that was a foster care. Uh, she was in foster care, and yeah. she was arguing with one of the foster care sisters, right? That came, right? Came to visit, and they argue like, "Yo, you don't clean up the house over here. Like, you don't clean up around here." And they will always fight about that. That's what the foster mom said, and it ended up being that. Just cover some dishes. That's crazy. That's yeah. I mean, it's a sad situation. It's a very sad situation because, you know, a young life was lost, you know. Um, That's true, Josh. He said tasers take time to power up because you got to take them out. Then you got to start Charge it, right? Yeah, you got to do all of that. And by the time she could have been stabbed by then. So, yeah, that's true. I mean, that's tough. But now what are cops What are cops going to feel like now if, you know what I mean? They're gonna feel like they can't do their jobs. I mean, at that part, I don't care. I don't like y'all, yeah, y'all, I agree. Y'all gotta, I agree with. y'all gotta do more critical thinking. Y'all just yo, you didn't see um that one cop that, that just started busting out the windshield. Nah, what happened? Nah. What happened? Um, they, sh- they shot some Spanish dude. Um he was he was um in a parking lot and he had a hammer. The cop thought he was a gun. The cop started shooting from inside the car through the windshield. Wow. Wow. And killed. Because the, the dude had a hammer? He had a hammer. Talking about, um, he got a gun, he got a gun. Like, yo. And just started shooting through the windshield. Like, and you that. He saw all of that through his patrol car? Or he was outside he, shooting through the windshield? Yo, he wasn't. He was in the back seat of the patrol car. He was with two other people. They were in, a, not even a patrol car. It was a, um, a pickup. They had like one of them um, unmarked um, pickups, and he was in the back seat, and he got he got like a, a like a rifle, and what you know the, yeah, and he started letting loose through what from the heck? so you like people like that like he was just itching to pull the trigger because if you want to shoot through the windshield past your other right. partners like you like what like you in the car like what was this man gonna do with a hammer like he was gonna throw it at your windshield and then what. It was gonna right. go through the windshield, boomerang, hit everybody in the head, and then come back to him. Like some yeah. destination joint. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Everybody, everybody's posting that video of that white dude with the knife that was lunging at the cops. Did y'all see that? Oh, and they ain't do nothing, right? They, they just they but why just... not? See, I don't like that because it's being framed like, oh, if it was a black dude, would it, why not just give kudos to the cop for being a good cop? And de-escalating, right. you know what I'm saying? Like, why right. does it have to be this black and white thing? You know, like, it's like a couple dude, of them. It's like the dude Marcellus was talking about. You know, you saying like, "Yo, like LeBron is over here complaining about 250 people dying, 250 people dying, but in the meantime, 700, 7,500 black people have been killed." You know, yeah. Like, you know, if if cops are killing people, let's unite. Let's 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 fight the police brutality. You know what I'm saying? Let's change the system. You know, but when we start segmenting it, like we're not gonna get nowhere. Mm-hmm. You know, because everybody's always arguing about, you know, oh these deaths are worse than these, and these deaths aren't enough. You know, we got more deaths than you, and this, you know, what I'm saying, and it's just it creates this inner conflict instead of like addressing the real issue. You know, what I'm saying, and like all this, like, oh, if he was black, if he was Latino, like, hey, maybe, but that's what we want cops to do, right? Regardless of the color. Like this should be an example. Yo, that happened out in Cali. Um, Jimmy. Oh, word. We gotta check Damn. that out. So I can't ride around with my hammer no more, huh? In Vallejo. It was in Vallejo. Oh, that okay, that's up north. That's where you used to stay at, no? Up northern Cali? Sacramento, yeah. Yep. Yeah. So crazy, man. That's wild. That's I, wild, man. I don't ever think it's going to be fixed, man. I just I think, think it's so a either. human heart, human's vision. Like, we flawed, bro. We're going to make dumb mistakes all the time. Dang, the dude was 22? Mm, sad. Sad, yo, sad. It is sad. There's cops out here. Wow. I wonder, I wonder what... Uh, yo, this man was on his knees? This dude yeah. that got killed, he was on his knees and they shot him. 
Yeah, with a hammer? Oh, yeah. He was. had a hammer in his waistband. I guess they were, they were responding to a burglary or something like a robbery. You talking about a hammer, hammer like a like a like a yeah like, like a mallet yeah. like Thor. Oh gosh, come on! Crazy. Josh says I know several minority people groups that say that they have had a pretty positive experience with cops too. Do we discount that? <laughs> 